The old lighthouse stood tall and proud on the cliff, its beacon a guiding light for sailors for centuries. But locals whispered tales of a dark secret lurking within its walls. One stormy night, a group of teenagers decided to explore the old lighthouse. They had heard the stories, but they didn't believe them. They thought it would be a fun adventure to spend a night in the supposedly haunted lighthouse and see if anything happened. As they approached the lighthouse, the teenagers could feel an eerie chill in the air. The wind howled around them, and the waves crashed against the rocks below with a deafening roar. They reached the lighthouse door and used a crowbar to pry it open. The inside of the lighthouse was dark and dusty, and the air was thick with the smell of decay. The teenagers wandered through the lighthouse, their flashlights illuminating the cobweb-covered walls and dusty furniture. They heard strange noises as they explored, footsteps creaking on the floorboards above them and whispers echoing through the empty rooms. One of the teenagers, a girl named Sarah, felt a strange pull towards the top of the lighthouse. She climbed the spiral staircase, her heart pounding in her chest. As she reached the top, Sarah saw a figure standing by the lighthouse beacon. The figure was tall and thin, with long, flowing hair. Sarah couldn't see the figure's face, but she could feel its eyes burning into her. Sarah screamed, and the other teenagers came running up the stairs. They saw the figure too, and they were filled with terror. The figure turned and looked at the teenagers. Its eyes glowed with an eerie light, and its mouth was twisted into a cruel smile. The teenagers turned and ran, but the figure was faster than them. It grabbed Sarah and dragged her towards the edge of the cliff. Sarah screamed for help, but her friends were too paralyzed with fear to move. The figure held Sarah over the edge of the cliff, and she looked down into the churning waters below. She knew that if she fell, she would be dead. Sarah closed her eyes and waited for the end. But then, she heard a voice. It was a woman's voice, soft and gentle. Let her go, the voice said. The figure turned and looked at the voice. It was coming from a woman standing in the doorway of the lighthouse. The woman was beautiful, with long, flowing hair and kind eyes. The figure hesitated, and then it released Sarah. Sarah fell to the ground, and the woman helped her to her feet. The figure turned and walked away, disappearing into the night. The teenagers were still in shock, but they were grateful to the woman for saving Sarah. They asked the woman who she was, but she just smiled and said, I'm the guardian of the lighthouse. The teenagers never saw the woman again, but they never forgot her. And they never went back to the old lighthouse again.